Welcome back to Lucha's Quest, everyone. It's your boy Zah. And we're getting into the Dozen fight. So, we're gonna start this fight off by using other Dozens against the Mercury Dozens. I'm using Venus, Mars, and of course, Mercury. So, the first one is Mercury. Then it's going to be Mars. And then finally, we're gonna drop Venus and then change up the strategy. But the reason I use the Dozen first is to find out which Dozen does the most damage. So I can use that Dozen to focus. And we just find the Mercury Dozen. First, we're gonna choose two basic attacks and then the ability Ray. So first up is Ray, and then the two basic attacks. Ooh, almost a critical. And he. Oh! He knocked out Shovel. Now he's almost dead too. Jesus. We gotta use Revive. Alright, Revive is gonna be used, and then I'm gonna use Ember to bring up my PP. So, Shovel's been revived. Nice. And it's the uh, Albie's turn to die. GG, Albie. GG. Now I gotta revive Albie. Albie's set to revive. And I'm now going to use my Dojin against my new Dojin. And boom, just like that, we have the Mercury Dungeon. Before I forget, I have to revive Albi since the battle is over. Now it's time for me to go fight a scorpion and get him out of the desert. But first, I have to heal up the party after I revive it. Before I forget, let's switch the Dojin over to Sheva until I get your boy Big E and get him on the water Dojins. Now, now that that's over, let's continue on the Yappy Desert. Do I even have enough PP to use? We only have 5 PP. Okay, I do. So, on to the next area. But first, we have to battle. I guess I can show the new summons that I have that costs 2 Mercury Dojins. Hopefully they die in Two shots. One, two, oh, and the three is your body. Sweet, the Psy Crystal, and that will restore all my psychic abilities. Alright, now it's time to re- to re heal up. Accidentally use Whirlwind. Now it's supposed to use Whirlwind. Now, let's go over here, go well, the wrong way, back on the right path, and use Pound, so I can climb up this ladder and head to the Scorpion, which the Scorpion is the boss for the Yappy Desert, and normally he would give me Scoop, but since the game is randomized, I don't know what he's going to give me, but it is a Scorpion. So, when fighting the scorpion, I have to use pound to scare it off into the next area. But if I hit pound too soon, it won't get scared at all. See? Just like that. And I have to repeat that process two different times just to start the boss fight. So wait for it. Let's see. It has to go that way. There's nothing going that way. Wait for it. Now I'm going to use pound. So hopefully I did it right, and we'll find out right now. And nope, that's a wash. We gotta reset it. Let's go try this again. Ready? Gotta wind up a little bit. Give me a sec. 
and now it's time to use pound. Again. Oop. Did it right? Yeah, did it right this time. Run, Scorpion. Run. In the next area, there's two different pillars. I need to pound one to align it with the circle so I can fight the boss. Here goes nothing. Here's my first pound. Sweet. Now we need to just do the second pound. Here we go. Big money, big money. Wait, gotta line it up first. Mm, big money, big money, no whammy. Stop. And I goofed. It didn't Gotta reset. Let's try this again. First, I have to line myself up with the pillars so I can get pounded. So, I failed, so it's time to reset again. So, let's try this again. We just need to align myself with it and then hit pound. Alright, now we have to restart all over again because he didn't move. So, let's just align myself with the pillar so I can hit pound. So, let's hit pound. Hopefully this time it will work. And did it. Yes. Oh, cool. Boss fight. Didn't even have to hit the other pillar. Dang. So, let's go boss fight. But first and foremost, before you boss fight, everyone knows, you gotta save the game. Just in case the boss beats me, I ain't gotta do all the boss work again. So now that that save, let's double save it, and then I'll let boss fight it. Man, that scorpion is spooky. But you know how we're gonna start off combat with the Dojin first. So you know, Earth, Mars, and Mercury. So let's see which Dojin does the most damage, so we use that Dojin to be. It's close to it. So the next move is Quake. But Albi is going to drop Mars. And Shell is going to summon her next Dojin, so this will be the summon. So Mercury Dojins don't do that much. So I think it's going to be fire tokens. And poison tokens are a lot of damage to me. So, I can't go down because I'm the only one who can revive the party. So, never mind, the summon does the most damage with 127 compared to the 77 that the fire does do. So, the plan is to work back up to my summon. But first, make sure I don't stop. So, I'm gonna line up the basic attack now. And then we're going to use Thunder. And then we're going to heal. So we're not like 30 seconds. That is almost cool, dude. So the basic attack hits. Yay! We're starting to charge. So we're going to get brown. One more time. So the march goes and does 81 damage, that's more than the last time, the first time is one. We want to move into gear though. So let me try out doing this. And then drop boom. And then heal. So the shove is healed, we almost heal up completely. And then I was going to use boom, and I'm going to use boom. Oh no, Shove is bad and poison. I can either heal it or go for the win. I'm thinking I'll go for the win, not for Shove. Because I don't have to heal poison. Let's go to the basic attack. And 
Sensation Thunder. And that's Sweet Mix. Sweet put it to sleep. And shall die. GG Shadows. But I can revive you. And then I'll be going to use my eyes. I'm going to revive Shadow. Not since I revived Shadow. It just woke up for it. I'm going to use Danny. I'm going to use my turn, so I'm going to go with my fall. And I'm going to go for level 2 summoners. Alright, hopefully I have enough money to kill it in not in that area. GG Scorpion's gone and we level up. Level 9, playing user Aldi. Uh, level 9 the win seeker and of course, you know, the boy became level 9. And we got a nut. We didn't even get a summons. We got a nut. Not even a summons, the psychic ability. We just got a nut. I was hoping Lash would be there. But I'm going to head off to the next town, and hopefully Lash will be there in that town. That way I can double back and go get Scoop and get all the other stuff that I missed because of Lash. But first, you know, we gotta get out of the Yaku Desert. So, let's retreat out of the desert, and then that is where we'll call this video. So, I'll catch you guys later, and if you like the content, like and subscribe. Laters!